Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, worshippers of all ages, welcome to YouTube. My name is C Raptor. Today we're going to open up some freebie containers, basically. Wargaming has uh, kindly gifted the community contributors 15 of the premium version of the In the Service of the Motherland containers that are new as a part of the latest round of the victory event that's going on right now in game. Um, I was just having a quick check over what ought to be in these containers. And if I understand correctly, the premium version should have either 15 of the camos or an e uh, the victory camos or, an e or economic flags. Um, it should have one of the new uh, collection items. There's a new collection for the game that's come with this patch. 25 of the new provision tokens that have been released with this patch. And then you have a random chance at one of four premium uh, Russian vessels. So let's, uh, let's start in on this here. Let's have a check. See if my assumptions are incorrect. Yep, so there's my collection item, my provision tokens, and my econ flags. I do love the econ flags. They are always so, so good. Yep, so there we go again. Econ, provision flags. I'm sorry, econ flags, provision tokens, and another collection item. Same thing here. More flags. I love. I do love me some dragon flags, provision tokens. Who have we got here? Commander of the Russian Navy. I think this uh, this collection has a segment on uh, Kuznetsov. He is, of course, the new fancy commander that you can acquire uh, as a part of this event. With I think it's I want to say it's five hundred of these provision tokens. You can pick up a new Russian or Soviet, if you will, um, a unique commander. There's some of the camos instead of the econ flags. I feel like I have too many camos. I feel like I would I would always much rather have the flags. Like there's always a use for the flags, but I look at the piles and piles of camos I have, and I'm just like, I'm never gonna get through all of these. Now I am curious because uh, I, I don't know that I'm going to actually get any of the premium ships to drop because I believe that I already own all of the ones that are in here, which if I read it right was Molotov, Lenin. Uh, I think Leningrad, what was the last one? Um, Akotnik, I believe. Yep. Do love seeing all those provision tokens. I'm confident, confident I'll find something good to spend uh, those on. This, of course, is all part of the second half of the victory event running on the server right now. The first one was for all the um, pr um, allowance tokens, which... Um, or could be used to, to purchase a Tier 7 uh, Premium Cruiser Lazo, if that was your thing. Uh, I picked one of those up. She is a ton of fun. I really like that ship. She's Tier 7 is a real sweet spot for playing ships right now. The matchmaking is really, really good at Tier 7. As soon as you step up to Tier 8, the matchmaking gets significantly worse for you because now you're going to find yourself up-tiered into games, Tier 10 games, very, very, very commonly. Just a few more of these to go here. I don't think you're going to see any ships because, like I said, I, I'm pretty confident. I'd have to double check, but I'm pretty sure I own all of those already. Got a few duplicate items in the collection here. But, again, this is really, to me, this is really more about the econ flags, if you want these, and the provision tokens. This seems like a really good way to pick up the provision tokens if there is something, uh, something amongst those provision tokens that you really want. There's some of the camos, more of the tokens. Medal for victory in the Battle of Gangut. All right, this should be the last one. If I haven't miscalculated, yeah, this should be my last one. This will be number 15. I love the image on this. The guys standing next to the shells. That always cracks me up. Awesome. All right, guys, well, there you go. That's 15. Quick, A quick look at the service in the service of the Motherland containers. Uh, available right now in-game as a part of the victory event part Two. Thanks for watching. Be safe out there, and I'll catch you next time.